Hey everyone, Dale here from LittleRVRentals.com. So uh, I've had this problem with this uh, Springdale travel trailer. Um, if you have the same problem with the slide out not retracting or expanding out, uh, check this first. So what I have here is a, it's a 2003 Springdale fifth wheel, but it would probably apply to most travel trailers or uh, fifth wheels. Uh, it's almost like a jack system that's underneath and sometimes they get stuck when you're bringing it in so uh, I'm gonna turn the camera on and I'll let you see what it's what I'm dealing with here yeah so this is the slide here and it was just when I when you push the button inside it's just going it wasn't it wouldn't come out it was almost like it was stuck so going inside here When I push the room out, it go ta -da 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 It's working now, but it wouldn't uh, it wouldn't move. So I thought it was a dead battery. It wasn't a dead battery because um, I was hooked up to shore power. So I uh, I crawled underneath, and uh, well, I'll have video of me crawling underneath and, and working with it. But after what I did is I made a mark on the floor, uh, not to bring it all the way in. So I left it maybe about a half an inch or an inch out. And uh, so you, what was happening is you bring it all the way in and then it would skip and it wouldn't go back out again for some reason. So I made a mark and as long as I keep it within that line, I'm fine. I can go out, I can go in. But if I go in too far, then it slips again. So you can do this. But uh, So here's my clip of underneath. So what's happening is when I hit the button, it's clicking back and forth and it won't move. So this is the whole cylinder system and it's on a track. It's just like a big oversized jack is what it is. And it rides on this and pulls these gears. It rides on the gear and then pulls the shaft out to, to take the slide out out. So what I did was I, there's a little uh, nut on the end of here. I just pulled it off and I'm going to get a wrench and I'm going to work it back and forth and to see if it'll break it loose and then use the electric button to see if it'll go. But right now it's just going ta da 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 It won't go anywhere. So it's almost like it's frozen, locked up. Put a crescent on there, put the nut back on with a crescent and try to work it out. It, it could be stuck. And then once it's unstuck, it should go back in and go back out again. So that's what we're going to try. Okay, try it again. Okay, hold on. Okay, try it again. Okay, go. Slide out's working. Okay, go back in. Okay, go out. Okay, go in. Okay, go out. Okay, go in. Go in. Okay, go out. Okay, go in. Okay, go out. Okay, hold it. Yeah, seems to be working okay. So I guess when it comes all the way in, Sometimes it gets stuck, so you just have to undo it a bit. I don't know why that is. Maybe I'll have to lube the track a bit, or this motor might be having a hard time. But anyway, it's freed up now, and it's, it's working. You might want to WD that that track. Yeah, yeah, grab me some WD and we'll put it in. But anyway, that's on the Springdale, and I'm using a, what is it, 5 eighths? Yeah, 5 eighths. Just to wiggle it back and forth. If it doesn't go one way, just go the other way with it. But that seemed to free it up. So as long as your motor's working. If it wouldn't be the motor, I would cut the wires and hook them up to a battery under here directly and see if that's it. Otherwise it could be the motor. But this is it's just skipping in there for some reason. So something's not it could be not lined up. But as soon as it comes in and bottoms out and then goes back out again, that's when it gets stuck. So the other option is don't bring the slide out all the way in. Just stop, you know, maybe put a piece of tape on the floor or something to stop the slide out from coming all the way in 
so you don't it doesn't trip the or get hung up so i hope that helped somebody help helped you out there um if it did you know please uh, uh subscribe and uh, give me a like below and uh, if you've had similar problems um, let us know in the comments what you've done it uh, helps the whole community so uh, thanks for watching and uh, take care